okay, we're going to do some shooting with the uh, Charmory gel beads today. We're going to check them all out. Should be very similar. They're just different colors. I don't believe we have any differences in hardness, or at least it's not noted on the Amazon item page. So we're going to go ahead and shoot some of them. We're going to use some different guns here. We've got um, Glock style here from Anstoy. This is the older original Glock style. So we'll go ahead. We'll give that a chance. We've got the current Desert Eagle. And then the tried and true AKM 47. So we're going to go ahead and do some different shooting with them. So let's just grab one. We're going to go with the multicolor beads first. Like I said, they um, should all have similar FPSs because they're all the same hardness, I think. So at least as far as we know. So first off, you know what, let's give it some, we'll give it some shots down range. All right. Now let's go ahead and check it out for FPS. All right, looks like right in between that 140 to 150 FPS range with the Anstoy Glock on the Charmory uh, multicolored gel beads. Okay, next up, got the Charmory blue gel beads, so kind of the standard. You see these a lot in a lot of different brands, just seems to be a popular color. We'll go ahead and go with the red, white, and blue Desert Eagle from Anstoy just because it matches, right? So let's get that on there. And these all have fresh batteries. So let's give it some shots kind of down. Okay, and now let's check some FPS here. All right, so looking between 130 up to 140, so kind of around 140 FPS on this. So not quite as strong as the Glock, but pretty darn close. And again, that is with the Charmory um, gel beads, in this case, the blue. Okay, got the orange Charmory gel beads ready to go now. Got them in an Ansoy AKM 47. Gonna go ahead, check it out. Like I said, I like to shoot a few down first. Okay, let's check it out. All right, we're at about 160 on the FPS on average there. So let's go ahead and let's switch this up and shoot some blue ones quick from Shermery as well. I assume we're going to get similar FPSs. So just to test that hypothesis. So, actually, it looks like we might be getting a little better. You know, looks like you're getting up to that 150 to 160 FPS range, at least, with the blue ones. So, maybe it does make a difference. Um, maybe the balls are slightly different size. There's a lot of variables, and they're pretty close in FPS. But that is the Shermery um, gel beads. Check them out. All right, we've got the Shermery green gel beads now or turquoise whatever you want to call it gonna try them first in the Anstoy M4 and then we'll go ahead and shoot them in the old style or original style Glock just to uh, give a couple cho choices here so let's check out the FPS all right looks like we're on average about 210 uh, FPS so that's consistent kind of with what I've seen with other gel beads, uh, regular gel beads with the M4. Okay, now let's go to the Glock style. So again, looks like we're around that 160 FPS. So, um, you know, consistent with what it was with the other color, Shermery gel beads as well. So I'd say all of their gel beads are probably the same hardness based on the FPS is being so close between the same gel blasters.